is a sad state of affairs. Students being forced to be prepared at all times for an active shooter at school. Well, now one West Michigan school is designing a whole new building specifically to help kids stay alive. Emily Leonard's in studio to show us. Emily. Brian and Sue, the new Fruitport High School is not ready for students just yet, but administrators and designers are making sure when the students get there, they'll be as safe as possible. Our Donovan Long got a tour of the building still under construction. We're doing everything we told the community we would do and then some. Still a hard hat zone, the new Fruitport High School isn't going to be like other schools. I think it's necessary in this day and age when you build a $50 million high school to really go back and think about uh, safety and security of the students. It's top of mind. Inside this new building, a security vestibule and the ability to lock all the doors in the building from a smartphone. And these, they're called wing walls. They help cut down on further the line of sight of an active shooter. You see that the hall is curved. That reduces the line of sight. Then these things come out to reduce the line of sight mm -hmm. further. Wing walls also give students a place to hide if they need to. Take a look at the size of the windows from the classrooms looking out onto the hallway. This allows teachers to keep an eye on the hall while they teach. So all of that glass will have impact resistant film applied to it. Okay. So if, God forbid, we had somebody wanting to do harm in the hallway, yes. it would take them a while to get through that glass. Superintendent Bob Shimoniak says the security improvements are meant to blend right in so students and visitors won't notice that the school is different. I want our parents to know that we are doing everything we can, not just in this building, but all of our buildings to keep all of our kids and all of our staff as safe as we possibly can.